All right, so looking at the uh, looking at the applied maths exam here, uh, overall, uh, I think this looks looks relatively reasonable. You know, for students that are kind of well prepared, there's kind of a lot of kind of low to medium hanging fruit here, but we're seeing quite a lot of stuff uh, that is being asked for the first time. Uh, you know, this is a relatively new syllabus, and some things are appearing for the first time. Some things are appearing for the first time at the level of difficulty that we have today and that's inevitably going to throw some students I think so you know being asked to create your own second order difference equation I think that will throw some students um, you know dynamic programming so some students are still coming to terms with dynamic programming and especially the equipment replacement and maintenance has always been a little bit hairy for some people um, you know the matrix form of prim's algorithm a lot of students have gotten quite used to having the choice between prim and Kruskal's algorithm uh, having Prim's algorithm being stipulated as the method to be used is, is inevitably going to kind of rub some people the wrong way. But apart from that, I think the rest of the the rest of the questions uh, we're seeing, you know, quite quite predictable, quite fair material that you know I think s students should be relatively happy with if they avoid the one or two the one or two things that they you know don't particularly like.